What's up? This here is Zarak. I hail from Sin City. You all know it as Cincinnati. I'm here doing an interview with my man, Big T, Todd. We in the house. Oh, man. I've been in the music game for a while. As far back as I can re really remember wanting to do it, age nine. Well, one thing I like about the music industry is that I have an opportunity or platform to put music out that speaks to the times we're in and speaks to the vibe of, uh, of the people who are looking and ready for artists that can bring something to uplift. And now, already beat down the vibe, the downtrodden some more. So, uh, the different flavors I bring to the game. Uh, we can get some reggae, get some ballads, get some down, right, you know, love vibes, like, uh, between the relationship between a man and a woman. And we also get some flavor of uplifting um, the women in our community, because I don't think enough of that is done. So. I mean, the flavor is all over the world, it's all over the place. So you can't lock me down as to just one type of music, but you can lock me down and say, hey, it's a rock with green. Not only it's a, a, a love vibe or a ballad, we're gonna go across the board and uh, hit you up with some real live uh, uplifting, uh, 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 uplifting vibe. Like you gonna give me something that I can groove to and get a message. Well, um, when I do do a live uh, uh, performance, I get a tremendous vibe. I mean, it has surprised me, the vibe that I get, not only from adults, but the little children, which is the most inspiration of all the vibes that I get back whenever I perform live. I performed in Washington, D.C., I performed in Philadelphia, New York, Brooklyn, New York. I've performed several times in Brooklyn, New York, baby. I love me in New York. <laughs> and, uh, Formed in Jackson, Mississippi, Jackson, Tennessee, uh, Jacksonville, Florida. Um, performed also, of course, in Cincinnati. And I performed in Raleigh, North Carolina. So that's just to name a few places I performed in. What I want to walk away with is that Zarat brought the noise, that he brought it down, that he, he, he brought the music right to my ears, I vibed the whole time, and if I had a chance to do it all over again, I'd do the exact same thing. A legacy is what the whole purpose of me, producing music and making music and singing music and playing music was that I can leave something behind once. This existence of me that you see right here has long gone and disappeared and has gone away of all earth. There will be music left behind, a legacy of the work that I have been blessed to make, sing, and produce. So that, in a nutshell, is the legacy that fulfills me and, and lets me know that everything that I've done up to now has now is in full circle. The legacy is the 360. This is the rock from my city to your world. You've been watching City World.